summer, 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 summer. <laughs> Ryan, you need to be careful. You're going to run into me. Hey, Gerald. Well, we did it. We finished fifth grade. Wow. And you believe that was the very last day of elementary school. What are you doing? Practicing my middle school look. Your middle school look? Now that we're in middle school, we're growing up and I need to be ready. It's the last day of school. The last day of elementary. The last ride home as an official kid. Feeling weary cause it's kinda scary. Surprises when it comes to mystifizes. It's the last day of normal! He's normal? Next year everything's new. But I'm not worried, not a bit worried. I'm not worried, not a bit worried. I'm not worried, I'm not worried. Middle school is gonna be awesome. You guys aren't gonna miss our old school at all? Well, of course, but middle school is gonna be awesome. You already said that, Ryan. What makes middle school so much better? Everything! Next year in middle school, we'll dissect frogs in biology. We'll get cute lockers like the big kids do. <gasps> we might get hairy. Ew, that's kind of scary. A fun adventure, a new chapter of our lives. We'll go up a few sizes after doing too much. Thanks, Gerald. I'm not worried at all. Excuse me, I'm starting middle school next fall, and I was wondering... They can't hear you, kid. Your music's too loud. I can tell you about middle school if you want. Is it true we get to dissect frogs in biology class? And that PE class is about real sports? And you get to decorate your own locker? <laughs> Middle school is a lot different from elementary school, and you'll get to do a ton of new and fun things. I liked middle school. Glad somebody did. I hated middle school. Leaving there was the best thing that ever happened to me. Why didn't you like middle school? I'm in a band, which apparently wasn't cool. I was too nerdy to ever be part of the cool group. They never let me in. That's awful, but at least you get to decorate your own locker, right? Yeah, real fun, until you get shoved into one. Want to hear good stories about middle school? Talk to Hector. He was one of the cool kids. I was only pretending to be someone I'm not. I was afraid people wouldn't like the real me. So I spent the whole time making up a new person. Ugh, it was exhausting. But it worked. You were one of the cool kids. Because I tricked everyone, but it wasn't the real me. And I never knew if my friends were real friends or if they just liked the fake me. Well, I like the real you. Me too. Personally, I loved middle school. You did? Do you want to know why I loved middle school so much? Because all the incoming kids would do exactly what I told them to, whenever I told them to do it. That doesn't sound like much fun. Maybe not for you, but for me, it was perfect. Leave them alone, Amanda. Don't listen to her, guys. Middle school's gonna be different, but you'll be fine. 
it's an adventure, but it'll be a good learning experience. You'll see. It'll be fine. We'll just stick together. Yeah, I guess. Hey, Toto. Did you have a good day today? <coughs> My day? It was okay. Last day of elementary school, which means after summer, I start middle school. Yay? I'm not worried. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. It's just like elementary school, but not. Hey there, little blue. Those clouds don't look good, Toto. It looks like a storm is coming. <laughs> There's a big storm coming. Glad you're home now. Me too. Come on inside. I just made cookies. You can tell me all about your last day of elementary school. Dorothy, honey, are you all right? I'm fine. You sure? You don't seem fine. Auntie Em, I was thinking, with all the work you and Uncle Henry have around here, it would be probably best if I dropped out of school and just stayed home every day to help out. And miss school? Not a chance. Your uncle and I are just fine with the way things are. Besides, don't you like school? You're off on a whole new adventure next fall. I think you'll be excited to go to middle school. I guess. Middle school is going to be so exciting. It's not exciting. It's hard and it's scary and it's different. And I don't want to go. Almost done with that tractor. Figured I'd stop before the store comes in. If I had just one more set of hands to hold things while I work, I'd be done already, but... See? I could help Uncle Henry. You guys need me to stay home. What's all that about, Little Blue? Dorothy doesn't want to go to middle school. She wants to stay here and help out on the farm. And end up as dumb as one of those scarecrows in the field? No way. But what if middle school is too hard and I fail all my tests? What if nobody likes me for who I am? And I can't make any friends unless I pretend to be someone I'm not. And then I forget who the real me is and I... This fake me forever. Or worse, what if somebody shoves me in my locker and I, and the door gets stuck, and I end up locked in there forever? You're being dramatic, Dorothy. All you need is an open mind, a friendly heart, and a little courage. Middle school would be different, but you'll be fine. No, I won't be fine. You guys don't understand. <laughs> Oh, Toto, I know Auntie Em and Uncle Henry are trying to be helpful, but they just don't get it. They were on the bus today. Everything they said is true. And Amanda. <coughs> what if I end up with someone like Amanda telling me what to do all the time? I just want things to be the way they were before. Why does everything have to change? Why can't it all just stay the same? Dorothy, there's a twister coming. Get up! <laughs> Come on, Toto! <laughs> Come on! Come on, we have to go! Come on, Toto, it's not safe! 
Well, Toto, now what? Do we stay here forever? <coughs> no, you're right. Let's go make sure Auntie Em and Uncle Henry are okay. <laughs>